What's going on guys? Coach Kiki here and assistant coach Brutus. And we're in the Bikini Dungeon. The Bikini Dungeon is my office. If you didn't know, it's in my basement. I have a treadmill, I have my desk, I have all the lights. Um, but I wanted to take you through my show day bag because the competition season is here and I wanted to give you an inside look as to what goes on in Coach Kiki's brain, Kiki the athlete. Um, I, if you know me, I am an over-preparer. I bring absolutely everything with me just in case you never know what is going to happen. Um, so it may be a little much. However, I wanna be prepared and then if any girl needs anything at any of the shows, whether I'm competing or just there coaching, come find me and I can guarantee you I have anything you could possibly need. Um, almost, I don't know everything, but I have a lot of stuff. So let's get through it. So first thing is my backstage pillow. I have a donut blanket as well that I lay on and then I bring this with me. I just put this on top of the roller bag and it's just cute, it gives me good vibes. All right, I don't even know where to begin. We're just gonna go through it all. All right, so I have all of my bikinis with me. So these two have two different Kitty's bikinis. Coach Kiki one will save you at kittiesbikinis.com. So I bring all of my backup bikinis. You never know what's gonna happen at me. Um, something may, you know, you never know. Something may happen and I might need to have a backup uh, depending on what color the backdrop is or if we're just wanting a different type of look, we have a backup. And then this is my new competition bikini for this season. I will be wearing it this upcoming weekend at the Clash Championship Series. And I cannot wait. Kitty absolutely crushed it. Um, there will be a separate video on Kitty's bikinis, but I absolutely love Kitty. She is phenomenal. <laughs> I swear, if something goes wrong, she will overnight things to me and she's just uh she loves what she does so much and she just wants to make everyone on stage feel beautiful so i have my brand new bikini and some brand new jewelry getting ready to go i'm excited and then i also bring a bag of extra um, boob pads um, depending on how booby we need to get or if we need to fill in any spots or if anybody else needs boob a boob job I'm your girl. I, I am not a doctor, so I cannot perform actual surgery, but I can get pretty dang close with some some stuffing of and moving of the girls. So I got that. And then I also have this that contains more boob pads. I have a measuring tape because you never no, like if I'm adjusting one of my athlete suits, I may need that. I have some breast lift tape as well as um, just some transparent medical grade duct tape for skin. So if we need to bring these girls up and keep them in place, I am prepared. I have my suit uh, recovery kit. <laughs> um, Kitty sent me some extra um, connectors for both the top and the bottom. So if anything combusts or if I just need to switch it out, I have extra connectors. And then I also have my sewing kit in here as well. Um, so again, just in case, I obviously have my shoe fairy heels. This is the beautiful pink box that the shoes come in. Um, Keeker's Laugh Fit 
will save you at the shoe fairy i've always used the shoe fairy these are the olympians which i absolutely love they are um like cushioned on the bottom and they wipe away really easily with the tan i'm actually going to pick another pair of these up this upcoming weekend and the shoe fairy is also releasing the nude version so we won't be wearing those for stage but it's essentially they're olympians and this clear part is nude and they have four different um, shade options depending on your complexion so Keekers Laugh Fit Shoe Fairy. Let's go. These are amazing on stage. And then last thing for like suits, I bring a uh, posing suit with me so I don't have to get my competition suit uh, dirty um, and mess with besides the stage. So I always bring a posing suit. All right, up next, goodness. All right. So I bring black towels because if you're staying in a hotel or an Airbnb with the tan, you don't want to completely ruin all of the towels. So black towels, I'll use this for obviously when I'm taking a shower, um, when Beckon is tanning me and um, yeah. So black towels and then also along with the tan this is a um, sleeping bag liner so i know some girls will bring dark sheets to put on over the hotel bed but i just prefer a sleeping bag liner um, this is a, a silk based one so that is going to help not have the tan transfer over like a cotton would and it's just easy i just put it on top of the bed and that's that's how i sleep I got my black silk long pants to sleep in because again, we uh, don't want the tan to get ruined. So you want something that's gonna be super baggy and I don't prefer using like sweats because I don't want to sweat off the tan. Um, even though we are lean and we are cold, um, I better safe than sorry. And then obviously I have my max effort muscle cover up so any sort of cover up um to cover up yourself <laughs> on the tan uh you don't want to be walking around the hotel in just your bikini so max effort that and then i have my max effort slides so again just um, a pair of slides the shoe fairy has some really cute ones too all right what else is over here? This is my travel scale. So this is just a weight scale so I can track my weight, especially since we want, we don't wanna be under a certain weight for me because I need to be full and tight. Um, so always track my weight for that. And it also doubles as a mirror. And then I also bring a mirror that you can go like this. So if I'm backstage or just in the hotel and want something that I need, y'all, you never know. You never know. So I bring that. All right, on to the tan. So I have my jug of Pro Tan Super Dark Coach Kiki for Pro Tan will have you save on your competition goods. So. I also ordered a small version of the Super Dark to have with me backstage in case I need it. And then I also have their Pro Tan. Uh, this is their instant top coat. So this is like a foam to go on top after the base tan of the Pro Tan Super Dark. Then I have one of their Pro Tan pads. So this is the car pad that you'll use to put the self tanner on. And then I have a container to actually put the solution in. And then we got some um, gloves. So Beckon's hands don't turn completely orange when she's helping me with my tan. And then, and here is some more tanning stuff 
We've got a back extender. So if you are doing it yourself um, and there's no one to help you, you can do that. I have to use this when Preston comes with me and Beckon is not there. Um, I have their new odor defender. Thank you, Brutus. Uh, so obviously we, um, when you are getting your, your tan, uh, you don't want to use deodorant because it'll actually turn your armpits green. So this arm odor defender is what they came up with to help us not smell so bad. Anyways, everyone smells bad, so whatever. Um, this is very important that I use. This is actually a light. Um, so I use that to just, sometimes hotel lighting can be funky if you're trying to take check-in photos for your coach. Um, and then Beckon also can use this to make sure we don't have any streaks or anything like that. Um, what else do we have in here? We have the Protan Show Shine. So this is like the um, glazing. I don't necessarily like when they glaze me, so I will just spritz a little bit of this on my shoulders to give a little shine. And then I bring an old like makeup brush that I will use to kind of blend in the tan on my hands, on my fingers, around my neck um, after like makeup, just to make sure everything is nice and blended. I think that's all the tanning stuff. Oh, important thing for the tan, Dixie cups. Now these are kind of small, but um, pea cups, if you know, you know, we don't want to splash. We don't want to get anything looking funky down here. So you poke holes in the bottom of your Dixie cup. Um, you pee. That's it, that's it. That's what you need these for, pea cups. The first time Preston, I think, realized that's what they were for. He, I think he had a heart attack. <laughs> um, all right, so we got a long, stretchy band for a backstage pump up. I'll also bring a pair of five to 10 pound dumbbells with me. So we have those. Um, this is all of my jewelry. So I have a lot of different jewelry options depending on what I'm feeling that day, what vibe I wanna give off. Uh, the Shoe Fairy is where I get my jewelry as well as Kitty's. So Kitty's Bikinis and the Shoe Fairy both have jewelry options. If you need help picking out jewelry, just let me know and I would love to help you. Just slide into the DMs, comment down below, whatever you wanna do. Um, this is my Coach Lacey makeup kit. Um, coach Lacey is one of my best friends. She is a makeup artist, she's a competitor, she's a coach. She helps me make sure I have everything I need for touch-ups, for my lips. So I have a bunch of different lip options. And then I actually have um, the... Um, foundation that she suggests. I just have this just in case. Now I'm getting my makeup done by Main Secrets Beauty, which is Ashley Janelle IFBB Pro, her um, glam company. Um, but this is just in case I need to touch up like before finals. Ashley is amazing. Her energy is just like phenomenal. So I'm excited to have her there when Stenza is doing my makeup. Um, so always have some touch up makeup with me. I also bring an extension cord because you never know when you need an extension cord. Those plugs can be hard to find in a hotel room. Um, what else? I'm almost done, I promise. All right, this is just a random assortment of stuff. So I have some Febreze fabric because smells. Um, blotting paper, I have uh, hairspray, I have a mini toothbrush, 
I have some um, hair gel, just in case we need to like put anything down. I have a lint roller. I have a, a flosser. I have a roll-on relaxing um, blend, relaxing blend roll-on, chill out. <laughs> it's like a essential oil. I put it behind my ears before I go on stage. Um, hair clips to put your hair back when you are getting your um, tan done. And goodness, what else is in here? Um, a mini hairbrush. Just some essential little girl things. You never know what we might need and you never know what someone else might need. So I'm prepared regardless of what happens. Um, and then I have uh, a body armor. This is what I drink um, after I get off stage. So this is the body armor light. One of my friends from Jacksonville, Andrea, she works with body armor and she was gracious enough to send me um, some body armor. So we got that. And then last but not least, these, this has nothing to do with backstage bags, but these are my um, measuring spoons for salt. So they go from 1 64th of a teaspoon, 1 32nd, 1 16th, 1 8th, and 1 4th. So I can control the amount of sodium that Coach Paul needs me to have. And that's it. That's it. That's all the stuff that I put in my backstage bag. Um, if you have any questions about any of this stuff, please let me know. Comment down below. Um, you can reach out to me on Instagram at KeekersLaugh underscore IFBB Pro. So if this is helpful, I hope it is. Um, like and subscribe to my YouTube and please let me know what you would like to see more of from Coach Kiki, Kiki the Athlete, and this is the show day bag. So competition season is right around the corner and all of my discount codes will be down below as well. So happy competing, happy bikini days. The bikini, every day is a bikini day, but I hope you guys learned a lot and let's fucking grow baby.